Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel PG Analytics. In this video, I will talk about one scenario that is asked in Citibank interview recently. And the question is, you have to show top 10 and bottom 10 customers based on the sales data without using set. In the same view, in the same sheet, you have to show top 10 and bottom 10. Let's understand how we can implement. I will drag the customer name and sales. So we will see the sales for all the customers. First, I will just sort this customer name based on their sales data. So sort it in descending order. Now we have to show top 10 and bottom 10. I will duplicate the sheet. The first thing we have to use a index function. So I have already written one calculation and just type the index function. Index function will start giving the number from one in the incremental order. So add this index in the row shell, convert to discrete. We can see index is starting from one and it will go in the increment order. It will go to the last row. So total number of customer is 773. Index will also go till 773. First function is index. Second function, we have to use the last. Last function will also start giving the number, but it will start from bottom. So let's drag this field also. And in case of last, you will observe here, it is a start giving the number, but remember last will start from zero. So in the bottom, it is starting from zero and it will go in the ascending order, zero, one, two, three, till the last row. So we have to use both function index and last. Now let's write a calculation. Index should be greater than equal to five. Now this calculation will return either true or false. It will be true for those rows where the index is less than equal to five. So for the first five rows, for the first five rows, it will be true right now. Index is less than equal to five. So first five row, it is true. Instead of first five rows, we have to show 10. So instead of using five, I will use 10. Now it will be true for first 10 rows. Let's see that. For first 10 rows, this calculation is true. For remaining rows, it is false. So we are getting the top 10 right now. Let's set another condition to get the bottom 10. I will add another condition here or last. Should be less than equal to nine. Why nine? Because the last is you will notice in the bottom, it is starting from zero. So we have to show only bottom 10 rows. We will use till nine. Apply this condition. You will notice first 10 rows, it is true. And for the bottom 10 rows also, it is true. From zero to nine, so total number of rows is 10. Now we will apply this field condition or calculation into the filter shell and select true. Remove this index and last, it is not required. So these are the top 10 and bottom 10 customer. Let's verify that with the previous sheet. We'll notice these are the top 10 and you will get the same number of customers in the next sheet. Similarly, you can verify the bottom 10 customer. These are the bottom 10. 
same customers we will get in our sheet. So without using the set, using index and last function, we can show top 10 and bottom 10. Not only top 10 and bottom 10, you can make it dynamic. You can show top end and bottom end without using the index, without using the set. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, any comment, please feel free to ask in the comment section. Also, if you are new to my channel, please like and subscribe. Thank you.